How to discharge a capacitor. A capacitor is essentially a battery uh, that is designed to hold voltage and release it very quickly. Uh, because of this, a capacitor can actually be very dangerous if not handled properly. Uh, so you want to make sure that you take some, some safety precautions when you are working around capacitors or if you need to discharge one. Um, you do not by any means want to uh, accidentally short the positive and the negative sides of the capacitor. It can cause the capacitor to explode. Um, it can also cause arcs or shorts and could also cause electrocution. So uh, we'll talk a little bit about the correct way to discharge a capacitor. Okay, this is a uh, relatively small capacitor that, as you can see, has been charged to a little over uh, 15 volts. Um, now, when I remove the power from the capacitor, uh, you can see on the meter, just the uh, power draw from the meter alone is causing the capacitor to start to drain. Um, but obviously, we don't want to sit here for a half an hour waiting for it to drain. Um, so the best bet uh, is to find something that will dissipate the energy uh, into heat, light, sound, whatever. And uh, one such item that can be used for a capacitor of this size is a 12 volt automotive bulb. And uh, all you need to do um, is to take the capacitor and touch the uh, ground to the case of the light and the power to the power of the light and you'll see the meter automatically drops down to zero. Uh, if it comes back up a little bit that's not a big deal, that's just a residual charge, but this capacitor is now safe to handle. Uh, if you have a larger capacitor, um, something in the uh, hundreds of uh, microfarads uh, that's being used say in a stereo installation or the like, uh, you might want to use something that draws a little bit more power, uh, like a small electric motor or uh, an amplifier or even a heater element, something like that. But all you're looking to do is to safely dissipate that energy um, into another form, in this case, light. And uh, that's the best way to do it.